Hey everybody, my name is Angie Moranga. You're watching Just Angie. It's May February. I don't know why I can never not do that without this little dance of my favorite things. And today I have one of my favorite people in the studio, in-house, and she's going to introduce herself. And I just love her story. I love her story. I love how she is. I just love everything that God has done with her, the success that she is. It just excites me. Comfort. Pastor. Hey. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you for coming, first of all. You, I'm so grateful that you came because I know how busy you are. Mm. But you've had this life mm. that when I listened to you, mm. I was like, no, comfort, I have to have you. My <laughs> just Angie family have got to meet you Thank because you. we like to encourage, to sure. inspire them, sure, sure. and to allow everyone to be something, you know, mm. even if you don't look like you can be something. Mm. So first of all, look into that camera, introduce yourself to wow. them, and then we can start and have a conversation. Thank you, and good afternoon, my blessed viewer. My name is Pauline Kesu. I know you don't know Can that. You see now my ID. That's my ID. I'm an M-Pesa. When you get to M-Pesa, first you want to see my mom, you want to say, eh? Who is Nani? Where is Comfort? Pauline. Yes, that's my official name. Oh, my goodness. You people, you I didn't even know that. I've known you for so long. I've never known you as, I've always known you as Comfort. Pauline is my official name. Okay. But Marketplace Bath Comfort. Yes. And maybe. Oh, Marketplace Bath Comfort. Yes. Yes, Bath Comfort. Wow. And I'm a mother of two boys. Wow. I'm married. I'm celebrating my 25 years in marriage. Wow. You said even all that? Yes. <laughs> Comfort. And huh? this is my birth demand. Amen, February. Yes. Wow. And I'm celebrating my 20 years since the day I left my village to come their life. In, in Nairobi. Nairobi. That's the story that got me. Because I've known you for long. <laughs> I've known you. I've seen you. We always yes. greet each other. Hey, Minister Comfort. How yeah. you doing? Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. You see, like now, I think we talk also Juju Sana. Because mm. I didn't know you were married. Mm -hmm. I didn't know you had boys. Mm -hmm. I didn't know you've been married for this long. Yeah. But then we sat and then you told me a story. I said, I have to talk about that yeah, story. Because yeah. your beginnings, Comfort. Sure, sure. What were your beginnings? Wow. Of course, the Bible says that we should not have despise humble our humble beginning. Mm. And let me say thank you very much, Pastor Angie, for loving me oh, and I accommodating me mm. and also trusting me and believing in me mm. and also giving me now a chance to share this journey. Mm. It has been the most exciting journey of my life because uh, my, my first seven years in the city, while wow, those years I was trying to step here, to step there, I don't know what I've come to do, because an option came through a man of a woman of God by the name Pastor uh, no Evangelist Junita Bynum, the prophetess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The year two zero zero four, she came to Kenya. She came to Kenya. Yeah. I remember. I can't remember the year, but I know she came And I Kenya. remember that time I was in the village. That is mm. Sagana. That's you were in the village. Yes. Uh -huh. um, this girl who was a prison, prison worship leader, a worshiper, you know, those girls, Wakanisa Kabisa, mm. a crusade. Mm. Those girls who could sing Kwabai with High with Nadarama, and you know. Uh, yeah. And I'm seeing Kwa advert of a powerful minister of the gospel coming from the US by the mm. name Junita Bynams. And anytime her advert could TV, I could stop whatever I'm doing and mm. I'm running there. And I'm like, Jesus, how can I manage to, how will I make it? From Kirinyaga to, to Nairobi. Nairobi. You know that time, now telling me to look for fear. Yakokuja Nairobi. And then, then who am I to that I'm coming for a conference? Mm -mm. But God made a way. A friend of mine told me, I'll give you fear. If you didn't want to hear this woman, I'll give you fear. fear. Actually, she brought me to Nairobi. We came. I will never forget the day we came to to, to, to Nairobi. We were told that Junita Binance is in KICC. By 6.30, we were there. In the morning? Yes. So you can imagine what time had I woken up. See, I was a journey in the... Will she be there in the day? She was... To, the first session was starting at 8. Amen. Right? With, I think, few leaders or something like that. Mm. But people never dare, cared. Whether it's leaders, everybody stormed KICC. Yeah. And I'm there at 6.30. And the hall is packed end to end. When I saw the multitudes, and the time I left Sagana, and I can't access the hall, I broke into tears. You couldn't access the hall? I couldn't Mulukwa access Inge. the hall. Yes. Oh my God. But the hunger and the thirst I had, that I was like, I just want to see her. What she, when, what she came for, me kumuona to me nikosawa. It never happened. By eight, we waited. By nine, we waited. At ten, I think Bishop Margaret Wanjiru and Bishop Makariuki walked in. 
and they made an announcement. We are so sorry. Ah. We can't bring the prophetess in because the hall is packed. If we dare, people will collapse here and die. And where I was seated, outside, oh, no, <laughs> but I cried. And now we were told, just all of you, go to Uhuru Park. We will wait for her. She will come. To Uhuru Park? Yes, at five. I cried. But when I'm crying, the Lord told me, comfort the day you desire to come to the city to see and meet this woman of God. The need you had was met then. So stop bothering yourself. All what you're desiring, you already have. Lakini, ni kateremuka tu. To Uhuru Park. I'm in Uhuru Park, and I'm waiting. From the time I start Uhuru Park around 10, up to 5, where I sat, si kuamuka. Ukienda utafuta hizo video, ni meka hapa Waiting to see this woman of God. And the message was, rise up and walk. That's the message she came and delivered. Yes. So for wow. me, this is how I interpreted. From the village, utoke ukuje Nairobi. Nairobi. Life was start in Nairobi. Yes. And Pastor Haji came. To meet nobody, to do nothing, to stay nowhere. Where are you going, comfort? I am telling you. Telling you're me. very bold, because where are you going, <laughs> comfort? And I remember that evening telling my husband after the crusade of June. Is your Kabana. husband in Kirenyaga as well yes, now? You're married I, in Kirenyaga. Yes. And you're telling him I'm going to Nairobi. Yes. He asked to me. do what? He, I told him I'm going to start sweeping the churches. Even if I fight Pastor Bishop Makarioki, I'll sweep his church. So you're going to at least serve in the church. Yes. That's where you're going to. Your starting I was point particular. is going to the church. And I was very particular. Serve in the church. Yes. And from there, God will do something. Yes. And I he could not understand that madness. But he released you I to go. I pushed. No, we went. We came together. Ah. Okay. <laughs> so you came together. And we settled in Nairobi. You started sweeping churches. I did not see the church. I discovered Nairobi, you must work. Prayer comes <laughs> later. <laughs> so, <laughs> nini I love this. Oh my goodness, so you started working. So I had a thousand. Nikaenda marikit. Gekomba. I picked some few things. Stuff like uh, bangles, some scarf, some sandals. And I came in the, uh, in the city, a city I didn't know. Started walking now, selling na ukochini, na kuta watu na ambia buy for me. You know, daring the impossible. I sold, I sold. Uh, I think for, for the first seven years, I was a very good hawker in the city. I you don't know, looking at you now, who can believe me when I met you? You know, you're saying, you now you look like you can hawk I am telling Hawking you, people from I humble could beginning. meet women like Pastor Angie oh who my are well God, packaged and tell them, eh? please buy from me. Oh, yeah, now for fair. Out, even I can see. I'll buy from you because comfort. But there's something that you have. You know, you have a grace. Praise you have a Lord. grace which, as we go this story, you will see. Yeah. There's a grace that you have. Yes, because I was very honest and sincere. Yeah. Just buy for me. I need fair. And of course, I could now say, to the question by 1,500, mm. I could come and say, this week, I'm, I'm working for, for rent. rent. And my husband is working for food mm. and fair. My goodness. And we could agree. Mm. So I did it perfectly. Pastor Angie, there's no street in Nairobi that I don't know imagine. my name. <laughs> you know, sometimes I imagine. Oh, but... <laughs> My sense has changed as a comfort. We have moved. God is with you. But it's a good beginning. Yeah. It teaches you many things. And for me, what I like from that story mm. is that you tried. To come yeah. from the village, to mm. come to Nairobi without mm. knowing anyone, mm. and then saying we're going to try. Mm. This 1,000, we're going to make it grow mm. and to make it happen. That's amazing. And that's why my passion to build women is so much. I know, because you have it. That even with the 500 shillings, a I woman can be built. Yes. A woman can be built. If you are honest with yourself, even a thousand, even now, Pastor you, Archie, even my, in these my days. car has things I'm selling anytime. Yeah. You know, once you're like that, even me, like now my car, it's it too. Too. <laughs> like now, now my things are my books, my what. I'm, you know, I'm a salesperson. Mm, so me, mm, everything mm, in a kangapo, mm. I have to be ready with it. Sure, so sure. that's amazing. So the first seven years were very hard on me. But you did well. And I never quitted. You could not convince me otherwise. I was always in church, Moiro's time. I could go there early in the morning, devotion. Then because I couldn't, I was leaving my house at 4 a.m. Nilipe 20 bob. Ili ni kuja wapi? Church. Church. Alafu na ondoka, saine ya usiku. Ili ni nipe ngapi? 20. 20 bob. Natukona my husband. We did that. 
that time we were childless. I know you don't know that. Mm. That was, I think, we waited for our children for 11 years. So, tulikuwa wawili. So, you can imagine. Ni nyumbani, sokoni, kanisa. Nyumbani. By then, we had gotten a father in faith up to date, who is called Pastor Gabriel Nganga. He's in Wairo Highway, Wanda mm. Stabanako Church. Okay. And this man started now speaking and building faith in me. And then he's graced differently. He shows a practical life in I faith. I like that. That's yes. what we need. We need a practical life in faith. Yes, don't tell we me God will come. Faith. Show yeah, me how. Show me how. Now you're speaking my language. <laughs> yeah, me because I would do, you know, and it sounds negative. Like when people are shouting in church, I say, okay, let's shout. Mm -hmm. To Kimaniza, immediately they shout. Next question. How? Yeah. So how are we gonna do this? So he taught us. You know, he I started opening it. our mindset. Yeah, I must. You must take me to see him. Mm. Oh yeah, we have to. Mm. He. He so he's opened up your mindset. Ah. You're even using the right language. He started changing me. Hey. And then you know there's that genesis from your village yes. that tells you you can't make it. Oh. At this version you cannot succeed in life. When you are like this, this you cannot manage. You know, so you come out from your village, you know, with mm. that mindset. I'm a failure. Here comes a man, especially the first someone he preached when I came. I'll never forget. Stop mourning a lie. Hey! Stop mourning a lie. lie. And you talk because about you have believed in this lie. Whatever because your I brother from said, the village. whatever your sister said, whatever your uncle said, whatever your villagers said, is all over your system. So by the time you're trying to move, take a move. You remember. They said. Ah. And especially one I will never forget. Come your talking. One eh. who I will never forget oh said. Now that life has worked against you, there's no education, there's nothing. Why don't you just go down kure moya, uwe unapanda mchele, na unatafuta kazi vibarua kwa watu. I told God, may that day never, never come, come to be. May that day never come. So, the man of God shaped my mind setting, my thinking, my capacity. And the day said, don't mourn a lie again. Ha <laughs> ha. Ilienda. Ikaenda. No more. And I started saying, I'm somewhere in the future and my life is looking better than the way it is looking. And it is true. From nowhere, I'm invited for a meeting at Yabiashara. And you're such a, your business is in your blood. <laughs> <laughs> it's in your blood. But now I was too much church, 98%. Too much church. Too much church. Kanisa. So the people who invited me for the <laughs> business. I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> eh? What is 98? You call? 98 the people who invited percent. you to the, you are 98% charge. Charge. 2% business. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So they asked me, <laughs> Nasasa, who call it business? Utakuja. Nikambia, eh. Nikambia, <laughs> whatever. I will just come and listen to what the business thing is. And the meeting is where? you. Where? Where? Nanyuki. Utatu wa fea wapi. That time ah. nikuwa ni mgraduate. Sasa fea. Tu mgraduate kutoka fea. Because fea na yobi imekuja. Wacha nikuwa ni mgraduate. Marabili. Niki comfort. Eh? That time. Eh. Nikuwa na uliza. Stock yangu ni 1,500. Niki tu wa fea hapa ni yende nanyuki. Isn't business okay, meeting. Isi ni uke ni kuchekele. <laughs> Haya. 1,500. Fea itoke hapo. I have to go for the meeting. Itoke kwa stock. So. Nikaona ata yo stock hako, pesa yiko kwa stock. Mm. So by the time I will sell and get fear to Nanyuki and mm. it is I think a day after tomorrow, what will I do? Mm. You know what happened? Mm. My neighbor, nikamwambia, please miss idea na pesa, niende conference ya biashara. Abi yaki, adi niuliza, eh? Business. Nanyuki, you. Why? Is ah. it you are doubting? That time I was selling nyanya paregi dhurai 45. Ah, with a wheel baru. With a wheel baru. Allow me first to laugh at you. Because you look know, comfort, I was looking at you, I was like, which, which story is this comfort is giving It's all real. Nyanya na wheel baru. Hapo kwaza jioni. Yes. And I could not stand the to slay girls coming to buy in the evening with two small cars. You Why know, they called me Mave. Mave. Hey. Aya. So your neighbor is a 50. Eh, 50. Na weka tu. Eh. Na kupangia vizuri. vizuri. Na kuletea kwa gari. Mm. Unanipatia a 50. Naona uki take off. Eh. Na say mam. One coming day. Back. I'm coming. Hallelujah. <laughs> and it happened. No more comfort. So now this your neighbor. Why is he doubting that you can go to conference? Yeah, ni kuchapa. <laughs> the warnings I was <laughs> given. <laughs> the warnings. What is by who? The neighbor. Ah, by if God. you don't <laughs> bring this money. Oh, Alikupatia? She gave me 300 shillings. Yeah, but the onion. 
Urudishe hii pesa. You know the confidence of I'll bring the money back. Mm. She was like, uh -huh. and you're going for a business meeting. I attended this meeting and I found professionals seated. I think corporate bank, they were handling, they were doing something. Mm. So I find these professionals, they are so smart with hard bags, with everything. And I'm like, guy, will I fit? So I sat at the back. <laughs> the hard bag then was, was the green paper bag. So I'm seated at the back. He was the loving at you. Pastor Hanji. A pastor walked in yeah. and saw me mm. and said, Apolline, ah, you're here. You're the one who leads us in praise. How do oh. And then you pray for us. Good to have you. The Kauliza. You see, you lead which people now? Ah. <laughs> then which song did I lead? Hey. But you're 98% Christian. But you say now, the people that no, the, no, no, the, the audience is different. Ah, let me try to be myself. <laughs> the audience is different. Yes. Yes. So, something taught me, comfort, do what you know best. Yes. In this setup, yeah. you know to praise yeah. and to worship and to read scriptures. That's what you know best. Do, do it. Now. Amen. I stood and I sing the famous Kikuyu song. Jesus, mm. thou I did it. I did it. Wow. I saw everybody lifting hands. Yes. You everybody is worshipping. Mm. And I said, ah, 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 ah. Uh, we are together. We are together. We are together in this. Do yes. what you know best. Amen. Don't That's copy. a good lesson. Oh. Do what you know best. best. Don't go try there to sing mm -hmm. another song. Sing the one you know. Yes. Amen. Jenna was saying, these are guys from Mount Kenya, what mm. are you? Mm. So we did the song. Mm. When I finished, of course, I, I felt a I, 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 I conviction to do a scripture. Ika. And Ika I read kutia. a scripture. You can read scripture. About the Tower of Babel. Where people come together. Ah, with a good motive. <laughs> things that can happen. Yeah. I said, <laughs> they all looked at me. I said, <laughs> let's pray now. They are all looking at me. We prayed. When I finished, very quickly, because Rudy, he didn't end up with the Hey, the owner of the program said, wait a minute. Mm -hmm. Go pick your hard bag at the hard bag. And and come here. Back. Come and sit in front. I, now, when I saw the guys who were in front, I said, Jesus, have mercy. But I sat there. They told me, even at 10, you do it. You at do, 10 again you read as in praise and worship amen and so my first job was to lead a corporate system praise, praise and, worship. and worship and i'm telling you i did it best amen but no, little did i know i'm understanding the concept they were selling because it was basically an investment firm mm. where they were bringing people together mm -hmm. and introducing them to investment opportunities we were investing in bank we wanted to do a bank of course we started uh, we started a bank we wanted to get into real estate so I was selling real estate. We have a lot of lands, even as we speak, mm -hmm. across the country. We wanted to do five-star hotels because the concept was, after all these big people exit with the famous names of the hotels that we have in Kenya, mm. who is coming in? Who is next? Wow. Who's so next? can we create a generation that can say, we also own Serenas? Yes. You know? Yes. Then we started now doing schools. We have two schools. We are very powerful schools. Wow. Oh, yes. We did a number of things. We had a... Uh, 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 we had uh, we had uh, we, we we also started uh, a technology company by wow. the name Fountain Technologies. Wow. So we had uh, I did Things a lot. Were happening. Yes. So I worked for that organization for nine years. Where kwanza umeruka? Kwani umeruka? Tulikuwa kwa worship. Tulikuwa worship ya asubuhi na worship ya ten. So sasa ukaingia kwa you got into that that. Whatever was being done here was investment. Because I think that's where I met you. Yeah. So there was investment taking place. So you joined. Then they told me, what else do you do? I told them, I hustle in Magikomba, in Marigiti, in Gidurai. Then yeah. I sing in church on Sunday. Mm. They asked me, would you might come and be singing for us, leading us in praise and worship? I told them, yes. Then come and follow. And so I started following them. What they were doing. What they were doing. And you see, I could say, now I don't understand this technical language of shares and the like. Mm. So I am not very comfortable in their setup. Mm. So what I would do, the three, four meetings I followed them, one of the meetings was in uh, Blackenhurst. And when I led praise and worship, I felt I'm not clicking this language of shares and all that. All these things they're talking about. Yeah. So I walked out. Investor language. Yeah. Mm. And I sat outside, sitting outside. Philippines 4, 
13. It dropped in my heart. I can do all things ah, 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 through Christ who strengthens ah, ah, me. Ah, ah, ah. Hey, that scripture was like a bomb. So I was checking. All means what? All means what, Pastor all, Angie? All. 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 Including what these guys are talking are talking in here. Investor language. I can do them. Nikamuka na kabage kangu. That time nikamu me promoti wa nikamu na hardback. Nikainuka na yo. Okay, Nika yeah, and, and you see, I used to go in that corporate uh, office mm. with bangos. Mm. 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 Bangos are angizote, maua ya rose flower, nimeweka huku, nywele inakaa funny, na bangos za maua ile za, you know. So unaka question mark in the meeting. <laughs> well, Which is true because I did a sermon, I think the other day recently, where I was telling God, I was reading Haggai, and God was telling me to tell people to make an investment, an economic investment in themselves. Mm. So this is what happened. So now you are looking like did, a question mark. Yes, little did I know, God mm. started opening. And when I, when I read the scripture, the Lord, uh, I told God, you're the one who opens, you're the one who opens the understanding of the simple. Lord, open my understanding. Let me understand what they are saying. From nowhere, the sixth month, I started getting what they are doing and what they are saying. You know, visions are caught. Yes. So what I did, caught. I around, the, I, I, I kept listening to the visionary. Mm. So I caught the vision. It is basically investment, bringing people together mm. for a common agenda. Yes. So leave me with the bottom lines now. Comfort kwasoko. Hmm? I started Nairobi. Selling. I went to Nakuru. Selling to people now. Yes, to the other idea, people to become investors. To sell the idea. Yes, that's what you are. Sell I the idea sure. and the concept to others. In five years, I met the best. I know. And they told me one day, we feel like you can introduce this market in Britain. Imagine. I say now it. comfort. Ume, now, 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 now. now. <laughs> now. <laughs> that's why I love your story. But my mentor the started end. now changing the, 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 the name. You know the background. He started telling me, you're too good in church and too good in scriptures. I want you to balance your life. I want to build your social capacity mm -hmm. and your economic capacity. Now you're talking my language. <laughs> you are talking my language. So you are, so sa you are too saved. You don't mm -hmm. love Quinta Mingo na watu wenye, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Nataka You have to mean Yes, because the, there's something that you know you don't know. Salt and light, yes. So he said, every day, ununue gazeti ila inaitua, business daily. Stop reading daily nation. Yeah, comfort. Oh, yeah. And you start reading So every daily. time in my desk, there was a business daily. And then he could ask me, yeah. tell me which bank made profit today. Tell me which company is going to Nas uh, the Nairobi Stock Exchange. Tell me which investment is trading in Kenya. Tell me, oh, I could Go read. Quite surely. Yes, then he told me, stop always watching news uh, CSR on daily. Mm. Start now watching with business, business news. Business news. I could wow, sit comfort. and listen and listen and wow. listen and understand. He's, he became my teacher. I listen. Wow. So this time round, he told me, mm. then you start buying books, the motivational books. Papa me, this man, man who used to do, he did a book, Papa me number. You know, he, he is a, he's a motivational speaker. Then I started buying books from T.D. Jakes. Every mm. powerful man of God, those books, Wow. I started reading, reading, reading. I go to business meetings, I go to business conferences. I, I'm still invited to come and pray. So we started balancing the arms. Wow. The godly arm? Yes. The social arm? Yes. And the financial arm? Ah, hey. hey. And then he started wow. telling me you would drive. Yeah, you know, I saw you coming out of your car. I was like, wow. Yes. Wow. Yes, it started now changing everything, changing everything. That time, the words from my pastor are still lingering. The voice, his voice was very loud to me that all things are possible. So I am, I, I, I'm told you go to Britain, and I'm like, chukua, chukua passport. I, I had a passport already. Chukua visa. And now, utaenda utakuta mtu. Mwe mukijuana, mutanza biashara uko. Ah, to sell the concept even yes. to the diaspora that is out there. My meetings were powerful. That's went wow. to central london went to oxford went to and britain became my home mm -hmm. i performed very well i was told you were very good proceed to the u.s honestly Sweet. then the, the my, my boss started telling us we want to expose you to or now the staff and the leaders who are working together with us we want to expose you across the nations that are very strong economically so we started with egypt we went to Turkey, we went to Singapore, we went to Malaysia, we went to China, we went to Dubai, you know, everywhere.
every strong economy. God opened doors. Other people started hiring me. Comfort, you want to sell for us this product in Canada. And you're such a good seller. Sell this to California. I am telling you, Pastor Angie, I did it. What I'm saying, the last 12 years, I've been soaked in the marketplace. You have. Until 2022, mm -hmm. the Lord started telling me, mm. your, your, your assignment is more kingdom. Is more kingdom. Yeah. So even mm -hmm. as you rise in the corporate land, I said, mm. do what you are doing. Make sure you are still in, in you are, you are in, still in, in the, the altar, and particularly in the altar. Uh -huh. You know, corporate can take you away completely from God, yeah. but no. you must balance it. It's so that balance, and God the Lord started telling me, please balance this. But you should know, you the, the, the final photo, your comfort picture, your image, your comfort, your mission is ministry. What? Oh yeah, and and that's why I'm celebrating my 20 years of God's faithfulness in the city of Nairobi. That I started in Marigiti, Yikomba, Yedurai, Rogai, Yedurai, Tomboya, Moy Avenue, Kenyatta Avenue, and now I'm in the protected area Imagine. of the land. <laughs> <laughs> you know, even when I saw you, I was like, well, now you're in the protected area. Yes. The highest, you're doing something yes. there. I am selling the vision of the First Lady of the Republic Can of you Kenya. Imagine, I am running Look at the God. program called Joy for Women, My bringing women together, training them on table banking. I did, you know I came from Diamond Trust Bank. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm. So when mama called me, I was in Diamond Trust Bank. So, so out of, after selling this vision, you yeah. went to the bank? Yeah. I've then done, I worked for Credit Bank. Mm. I then worked for CDN Abate. I then came to Credit, uh, Diamond Trust Bank. Briefly, not too yeah. long. Then mama so mama called, called you from there? Yeah. So your name must be out there, that oh, you're this. Yeah amazing sales person yeah. who can sell so, the vision yes i'm basically now training women on how can we come together mm. and make create our own bank and then you know good and you know also mm. i feel like okay create our own bank because then there'll be borrowing resources from this bank mm -hmm. and building themselves yeah. but i think for me the genesis of the story is mm. you were that woman mm. who took 1000 shillings mm -hmm. and made it happen mm -hmm. so there's no you're not, this is not a theory mm -mm. you are telling people. Mm -mm. This is the life I have lived mm -hmm. as comfort. And then I have grown through the mm -hmm. ranks, taking another step, taking mm -hmm. another step, mm -hmm. taking another step. Mm -hmm. Until now, you can also train them. Sure, I think it's sure. a powerful sure. story. Comfort. Then I also allow <coughs> myself to work with people better than me. People don't like that. People want to be in their own environment, which is very dangerous. I started working with people who are learned than me. Mm economically empowered than me, than you. socially empowered than me, and spiritually empowered than me. You. So you fight, wow. I can only learn and follow. I don't work with competitors. Actually, I don't have a competitor around me. If I discover we are meeting to say, hey, you have a nice car, we talk about cars, I leave that WhatsApp page. Mm. I have worked with women who are better than me, wow. by far. So I only learn and follow, you know? And it has been one of the most exciting journeys to appreciate that you can grow yourself to a level whether everybody gets out of your life, you can still stand you can still and start stand. again. Oh my goodness. Oh fight. yeah. Oh yeah. Right now I'm doing a lot as much as I'm working for the first lady. Mm. I'm doing poultry. If you want to do poultry farming, I supply chicks from one week to four weeks and I'm doing it big time across the country. I am also now doing, okay, I sell fish, I mm. sell chicken, I sell anything wow, eatable. You sell, I am. You sell anything eatable? <laughs> yes. Uh, and now oh, the that's... program of the first lady, I'm doing capacity building mm -hmm. and also tr introducing women into livelihood activities. Mm. So we are doing a lot of poultry farming. We are doing so even then they can do their own poultry farming, yeah, we, sell fish, we, sell anything eatable. Yeah. Yes. Even them, even them, yeah. They can enter there. And it's such oh, a joy. Comfort. And I'm never excited of anything anymore. I know God can do all things. That's wow. why I'm back in the altar. I launched a very powerful fellowship yesterday and Monday at 6 You said, and you must just yeah. invite me. I must yeah. come. It's monthly, every yeah. last Monday of the month. Every last Monday of the month yes. at 6 80. Yes. We okay. Were full house. What time? 6 o'clock? From 5 30 p.m. And you're the one who's doing the fellowship? 
Um, it's my fellowship, Amen. My, Amen. but I invite preachers, so you can imagine oh, you're yeah, in my I list. I'm put to be the list. <laughs> I'm also ready to come and receive. You know, it's also very powerful comfort. Yes, yes. Because, okay, I know some of your story. To mm. see what God has done with mm. your life mm. is such an encouragement. Mm. It is, we can never give up. Mm. We must keep going mm. because God can do anything with us. Oh, sure. And trying, because you came out. You came to receive your little binary. You came to and, and you relocate see, Pastor, to Nairobi. And you are forgetting. Hey, 2004, the same mm. 2004, I was invited for a meeting at Kutus mm. by, you know, Pastor Lee. Yes. The father was His Pastor father, Lee. Bishop Karaoke. Bishop Karaoke. Yes. I'm invited, but now it's my pastor who said, there's mm. a pastor's meeting happening at Kutus. Mm. Would you mind God present me? Me. So my pastor in Kagyo sent me. Mm. And I'm in this meeting mm. for one week. Who was the preacher and the speaker? Evangelist Teresia Wairimu. You said, yes. And you know, for me, I see her, I'm like, oh, shh. Wow, we yeah. <laughs> are. We're like, wow. So she One could day. come. Nikwa naka nyuma. You know, behind, because I'm not a pastor. I used to, mm. stay, to sit behind. Just to represent my pastor. And Pastor Haji, I'm seated. And I could see mom walk in. My tears could flow like this and wonder, God, how do you raise women like how this? How do you raise women like yes. this? And to the last day, because the conference was taking five days, the last day, the Friday, there was an anointing service. This anointing service was me me meant for the Pastors. ministers. Mm. So comfort, where the layer kuka nyuma. But that night, because ni kwa nalala kanisa, ni kwa floor, na kama mattress. Yeah, uto pesa wapi ya hoteli. So um, um, that night, 5 a.m., no, 3 a.m., I jumped from that kamatres kwa kanisa, mm. and I was at the compound of the church. From 3 a.m. I was pleading with the master, Lord, may this woman of God speak to me today. What? I'm not a pastor, but Lord. Yeah. So mom comes, and now the service started on Friday, and then in the after, uh, at 12, she said she's going to start the anointing service. And she's now up there. Everybody said the atmosphere is heated, the power of God is present, and now she Scribes up the altar and she started speaking about the anointing oil and of course now calling people, you know, the bishops. She called the first team. When she called the first team, she stopped and she said, wait a minute. And there was silence in the hall. She said, I'm looking for somebody. You know the way she speaks. I'm looking for somebody. I'm looking for somebody. Then she stepped the first step down. She said, I'm looking for somebody. So the atmosphere shifted. Because she has stopped and she has walked down. And then she went down further, saying, I'm, I'm looking, looking for somebody. somebody. So for me, I'm like, if that person cannot, cannot be, me. be you. So she walked only to find Amekuja lawyer where I was seated. She came direct, walking, the whole protocol now rose and followed her. And she's saying, I'm looking for somebody. I'm looking for somebody. She walked. She walked. The tension and the atmosphere is now heated. And the protocol has followed her. I'm at the corner, Pastor Hanji. I'm at the corner. At the corner, kwa ile kitia form. I'm crying. I'm kneeling down. I couldn't even sit when now she started now coming so close to me. Oh, and, I'm, and I'm there and I'm crying and I'm looking at her and she said, oh, I'm looking for somebody. She came direct to the head of that law. She looked direct to my seat at the corner and she said, I'm looking for you. I'm looking for you. I'm looking for you. The protocol came and picked me up. I could not walk. I was taken to her. She laid, she looked at me. I was so beaten. I was sleeping in the hall for five days, even eating. You know, I, it was, I, was, I said I'm in, the, I'm in the mountain. I'm there for five days. I've starved but I fed a lot. And now she looked at me. I looked at her. She said, you. She looked at my feet. 
she started with my feet. Ikuwa na mechapa ya tuza sandals zile za black. She said, this feet will travel across the nations of the world. What? She said, I know you are mourning an academic setback. You will rise above the academic papers. What? And nobody will stand or resist. And the Lord will honor you with his presence. Wherever you will show up, the presence of God will show up. Will show up. She asked for an anointing oil. She anointed me. Imagine. And she told me, the world will know your name. I slept there. The meeting shifted from everybody to where we were with mom. My God. So, she told me, there will be no platform bigger than you. Bigger than you. Mm. I climbed there. I could not leave that place. This, I don't know how the service continued after that. And I picked that word. Yes, Pastor Angie. She's the one who unlocked that. I've been that. to every continent. You have been to every of continent. This world. Every single I've continent. I've gone to any platform. I've spoken in many platform, corporate, name it, church. All what mom said came to be. It's come to pass. And right now, the office I least expected, came the calling. office of the first lady came of the calling. Republic, came calling. My goodness, come there. I want to encourage that person. Encourage them. It's your camera. It's your camera. Encourage Don't them. Don't you give up. Build yourself in faith build your capacity and the last one which i tell people every day let your hands work pastor Aji, the lord blesses the work of your hands of our hands even if we keep speaking in tongues 24 7 no. even if you go to karura forest for one month and you're not working there's nothing there's the lord can be trace action. in your hands Things will never, never work. work. Utachukia mungu bure, utachukia wa kristo bure, utachukia pastor bure, but the life that you have, you are the one who is supposed to take responsibility. Ability. It feels nice when I shop in London, when I, there I was in mm. South Africa last, last year in June, and I am in this shop, I'm shopping for myself. And I say, is it not good to get to your pocket and you buy your own thing? Yes. So, Pastor Aji, I am encouraging especially believers. Let's not blame people. Let's not blame each other. And blame God. Let's work. Let's work. And that's so true. Me, I've been saying there's an action. After the praying, after the reading the word, after the fasting, after the attending, there has to, what is the action? Practical ministry. What am I going to do next? What do I need to do next? Because you had to do a lot. Mm. You had to remove yourself. Mm. From, 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 from the village mm. and come to the city. Mm -hmm. You had to go to those two, Gikomba mm. and to Marigit. You mm. had to stand there at that Gedurai mm -hmm. roundabout. You, you stop at Mapsa mm. and you say, even me one day I'll drive. Mm. Now but, I drive um, by the highway of Gedurai, <laughs> not the road. And, and I'm driven. <laughs> I don't drive. Shetani <laughs> Ashindo. Purulizo. And then two, prophet, two prophets. Yes. Like, Two prophets spoke over yes. you. The prophet, that time of Juanita Bynum, mm -hmm. and then Reverend Teresa. Yes. Well, thank you so much, Mom. Mm. But that is amazing. That, yes. that an encounter with God. But you demanded it as well, isn't it? Mm. At night you were praying, may she see me. Oh my and God. God stopped her and brought her to where you are. And anointed you. And then you went in obedience. Because your, 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 your bishop said go, mm. you slept in the church. Mm. Yeah, me, I'm telling you comfort. Mm. But it's all good. So that it doesn't matter which hotel in the world you sleep in. Mm. You know that you do what God has asked you to do. And that's why, for me, you're such an encouragement. And of course, when I met you, I didn't know all wow. these things. You were just a mover and a shaker <laughs> in the investment <laughs> space. I'm like, who is this woman doing all these things? So at least it, it was good. Um, it was actually travail where we sat down. Mm. The things you told me, I was looking at you like, what? Mm. Like, thank God. Mm. Thank mm. God, God has that God. God has come through. We celebrated so much on Monday with Amen. my team Amen. in 680. Because God told me, I'm giving you the city. Yeah, I think he can give you the city. And not just Nairobi city. Mm. 
you've been to London, you do this fellowship. And you did that. You called them to invest and they yes. came. And I'm going now. I told my people, I've been going across the world for business. Now I'm going for God. For Jesus. And what did he tell you? The last image of comfort is the kingdom. I cannot wait to see the end of this. But I'm so grateful, Comfort. Thank, Thank you for you. coming. You're welcome. And I keep telling everyone we're going to have them back. Yes. Because we have to see how that story has yes, continued. Yes, 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 what yes. else has God done? But thank you for coming to share your story with mm. us because it inspires us. Mm. It, it motivates us. Yeah. And it's an authentic story of mm. how we can, what we can do. Sure. You know, the people say you go to America to fulfill your dreams, even Kenya. Ah. You can fulfill them right here. Visit and come you back. can come and do... You can, you can do great things mm. and just dare God and, mm. and make that move, you know, mm. and don't get stuck there in your house and mm. do something. Mm. Comfort, thank mm. you. Mm. Thank you so, so much you are welcome, for sharing your story. Thank you. And thank you for an amazing mentor, mm. the, the, the minister, the, the, your mm. spiritual father, mm. for teaching you practical mm. faith. That mm. is, now that one excites me like crazy. <laughs> practical you. faith. Thank you, Pastor. God Andrew. bless you greatly. Bless you. Thank you very much, yeah. Pastor. Not God bless you guys. I hope you've enjoyed that. Here is, I love it. <laughs> God bless. Bye-bye. <laughs>